जी नमस्कार 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 अमित जी Kanazi, uh, what a pleasure to meet you after so many years, and uh, you look, you look, uh, you look amazingly uh, positive and charismatic as always. Welcome to Vision. Well, I try to be positive always. Welcome to Vision India at seventy-five. It is Thank Amrit so Mahotsav series. It is the Amrit Mahotsav series celebrating seventy-five years of India's glorious past, and paving a road map through the monologues and through the. in experiences of top leaders speakers performers like you indians like you who can lay a road map for generations to come over the next 25 years when we seek to achieve the podium finish in terms of being the numero uno country in the world and we are very close to it let me tell you that and your contribution is also very important because you people contribute to the you know soul you don't contribute to anything else but the soul and with your singing with your arts with your performances you have uh, in a, you know in all the audiences world over i would now uh, leave it to you to take us through your journey over the last few years you and also as to you know uh, where do we stand today in terms of the in terms of the genre of music or the genre of music as we say and going forward uh, what would be your uh, suggestions expectations from the industry from the society and what would be your suggestions to the youngsters who are now uh, overtly uh, inclined or skewed in favor of this if i may say distorted music if i may say chaotic music if i may say cacophonous music A music cannot be cacophonous uh, so i would like you to take us back to the year of years of melody and help us understand how we can reignite the glory of the past over to you madam pinaz masani thank you amit ji these are very poignant questions very relevant to today's times where uh, though we are very lucky that we are living in a time where our our, our, our honorable our respected prime minister be it music be it meditation be it yoga हमारी हम ऐसे खुश नसीब है कि हम ऐसे देश में पैदा हुए हैं जिसका नाम है भारत हिंदुस्तान जहां हमारी तहजीब संस्कृति धर्म रिलीजन सो मच ऑफ डाइवर्सिटी एंड इन दिस डाइवर्सिटी दिस यूनिटी देर इज ट्रेडिशन वी डोंट नीड टू लुक आउटवर्ड फॉर पीस वी जस्ट हैव टू लुक within we have to seek we have to seek to find ourselves and this we can do if i am a musician mai ab sangeet se karti hu ya koi aur ho to wo nritya se karta hai ya an artist will paint and get inspiration from his art so i was very now coming back to myself i was very fortunate to have been born in a family which had roots in indian classical music Uh, मेरे पिताजी माय फादर मरहूम डॉली मसानी जी वाज एंथुजियास्ट ऑफ म्यूजिक एंड ही लर्न फ्रॉम उस्ताद आफ्ताब ए मौसीकी फयाज खान साहब ऑफ द आगरा घराना नाउ वी आर गोइंग बैक टू द ईयर 1925 टू 1926 जहां पे बरोडा में लक्ष्मी विलास पैलेस में सियाजी राव गायकवाड़ महाराज हुआ करते एंड उनके कोर्ट म्यूजिशियन थे फयाज खान साहब जी और पापा ने उन्हीं से सीखा तो जाहिर है जिस घर में गाने बजाने का माहौल हो बच्चों को शौक हो जाता है मुझे भी शौक हुआ मैंने भी क्लासिकल म्यूजिक सीखना शुरू किया उस्ताद अमानत खान साहब जी से आफ्टर दैट इयर्स वेन बाय आई वेंट टू स्कूल आई एंटर कॉलेज एंड एक म्यूजिक कॉम्पिटिशन में मेरी मुलाकात एक हमारे देश के बहुत ही मशहूर बहुत ही मायना संगीतकार जयदेव जी से हुआ जयदेव जी ने हमें ऐसे ऐसे गाने दिए हैं अल्लाह तेरो नाम ईश्वर तेरो नाम अभी न जाओ छोड़ के कि दिल अभी भरा नहीं तो जयदेव जी जज के हैसियत से आए थे नौशाद साहब थे राज कपूर जी थे और जयदेव जी थे एंड उस उस कंपटीशन में सुर सिंगार था कॉम्पिटिशन का नाम उसमें मुझे पहला इनाम मिला और जयदेव जी को बहुत खुशी हुई कि एक पारसी लड़की 
जो ज्यादा पारसी पारसी वैसे तो पर्शिया से आए हैं हम हम पर्शियन जानते हैं हिंदी उर्दू सब वहीं से आया है लेकिन अंग्रेजियत ज्यादा है तो एक पारसी लड़की को क्लासिकल म्यूजिक और आ, अच्छा आ, गाने की कोशिश करते हैं तो जयदेव जी टुक मी अंडर हिज विंग्स तो उन्होंने कहा कि अगर आपको और सीखना है तो मैं चाहता हूँ कि आप हिंदुस्तान की बेमिसाल फनकारा मधुरानी जी से सीखें तो अमित जी इस तरह से मैंने आ, मेरी गुरु मधुरानी जी से गाना सीखना शुरू किया गजल सीखना शुरू किया गजल सीख ही नहीं जाती है गाना सीखा जाता है तो ये गलत बात है कि मैंने भैया गजल इनसे सीखा भजन इनसे सीखा ठुमरी फला से सीखा मैंने गाना सीखा गाना जरूरी है बाकी आप कुछ भी गा सकते हैं फाउंडेशन होना चाहिए तो इस तरह से मधुरानी जी से मिली मैं गजल से मिली और मेरा पहला एल्बम रिकॉर्ड हुआ नाइनटीन में और उसके बाद आई बीन सिंगिंग फॉर हाँ फोर्टी ईयर्स हो गए वी ऑलरेडी पास ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन तो फोर्टी वन ईयर्स से मैं गा रही हूँ आई हैव रिप्रेजेंटेड इंडिया अब्रॉड ऑन में पहला एल्बम निकला आप गिन लो ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन तो हो गया I have to ask my team because they have given me false information because I was told you are hardly forty. Acha, thank you, thank you. Banaye, banaye, baate. <laughs> Yay! I'm, 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 I'm twenty-five at heart, and uh, uh, so that's how I started uh, music, and I represented India abroad on a wonderful platform of Indian Council for Cultural Relations, taking. our culture to various countries whether it was africa whether it was korea whether it was vietnam whether it was america it was mexico so you know, mauritius of course i've done the south countries they started say uh maine gana sikha aur seekh rahi hu and you talking another question which you said was uh uh country Uh, are youngsters more grounded towards indian classical music to zyada programs aise ho jo government karti rehti hai ghazlon ki classical music ke and to imbibe in them to listen to pure music to listen to classical music to listen to uh, music that soothes the soul because uh, we are finding a lot of cases where youngsters are very stressed itne targets diye jate hain bechare logon ko ke wo target achieve karte karte itne stressed out ho jate hain they burn out even young singers jo aajkal itne talent hai apni country mein look at all the uh, programs we have on television they are so so talented but itna unko uh, stardom ग्लिड्स ग्लैमर के पीछे इतना बेचारे मासूम बच्चे हैं इतना उसमें उनको पुश कर देते हैं दैट इट बिकम्स डिफिकल्ट फॉर देम टू सस्टेन देयर लाइफ सो इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कि जस्ट डोंट बी जस्ट डोंट बी अ वन जस्ट डोंट ऑपरेट फॉर अ स्मॉल स्पैन ट्राई एंड लर्न योर म्यूजिक यू कैन really go on for years and years and contribute to the society and contribute to your arts to the world that's important yeah pinaz ji why ghazals i mean you learned singing see i am uh, through this program our uh, through this series which is a mission uh, ably supported by initially uh, right from beginning dr general vk singh <laughs> honorable minister of state Chief. road transport and safety government of india as well as civil aviation today he was the chief of the army staff he was somebody and he is somebody i credit for uh, i not credit i am nobody to credit or discredit anybody i am thankful to such people uh, general vk singh general chaturvedi left general chaturvedi brigadier rajit apte one of the finest uh, army personnel captain admiral robin dhawan I, i make it a point to name as many people as i keep remembering especially by rotation but these are few names these are few names which are fixed i mean you know you know uh, my, my when i started the music series in last year because classical music and india are inseparable 
just like yoga just like ayurveda just like uh, you know ye hamari sanskruti hai yes this is our tradition you can't take our tradition out of us exactly so when we started we uh, got lot of support from people like pandit shubhan bhat ji pandit patmashri shoma ghosh ji uh, these are the kind of rajiv uh, mahavir ji son who is a famous composer in mumbai i i myself had a lot of support from mr b n tiwari the president of the film uh, western uh, you know federation for western indian cinema employees these are the people because i have nothing to do we had nothing to do with the movie industry but you know gradually I realized this is inextricably linked to india's happiness the happiness quotient of india depends on music and india is india can contribute to this world immensely through music which uh, uh, i know we should not be diluting our own strengths so why did you choose ghazal or bhajans as a genre for uh, uh, singing and do they have a different genre or is it the same in uh, hindustani music and carnatic music no hindustani music and carnatic music are two very different streams of uh learning but uh, amichi sur sur hota hai sur ki koi bhasha nahi hai it has no language it just has to touch the heart strings you can have a persian singer singing and you will have tears in your eyes when she just sings something that is the power of sur i remember when i represented india in ghana we had the ghana president and prime minister who knew not a word of ghazal starting from g and i was singing a ghazal in darbari shakil badaini ki ghazal thi meri zindagi hai zalim tere gham se aashikara unko kuch nahi pata iska kya meaning though we had a translator but jo raag darbari hai jo alap hota hai jo unko acha lagta hai wo 5 minute ke liye aaye the they sat through the one and a half आज प्रोग्राम तो ये सुर है जो टच करता है लोगों को एंड वी मस्ट दैट इज व्हाई आवर कंट्री आल्सो यूजेस म्यूजिक टू कम्युनिकेट टू अदर कंट्रीज ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड दैट्स व्हाट द आईसीसीआर इज ऑल अबाउट और व्हेन वी रिप्रेजेंट अब्रॉड इट्स म्यूजिक दैट दैट इज अ लिंक बिटवीन कंट्रीज मोर देन एनी अदर डिप्लोमेटिक रिलेशनशिप्स आई थिंक म्यूजिक इज द बेस्ट बेस्ट टूल टू कम्युनिकेट लव हैप्पीनेस friendship togetherness compassion it's all done through music you know uh, it's quite uh, you know uh, kind of confusing to see that we have a sport called cricket which is uh, generally referred to by people by by you know the uh, power centers as something which could be a unifying force and we've had instances of cricket being hosted this world cup semi finals being hosted in chandigarh mohali uh, where in india and pakistan have without any third party intervention with uh, complete uh, transparency reached the semi finals at the same time and the entire world has gathered on the mohali ground to celebrate cricket as a kind of a you know a unifying force between these two parted nations but here we have something called music wherein uh the pakistani singers uh, you know who started contributing so much in terms of uh, right from mehndias and khasawar as far as i remember to to uh, this gentleman who sings uh, you know uh, the let us rahat fateh ali khan you know all these guys are some wonderful singers uh, the atif aslam you know i am not for this or that i am not uh, i am not trying to you know put my nationalism on my sleeve based on patronizing any singer from any country especially not from an enemy country like pakistan but music i believe should have no country should have no nationalism as you just now said it is something which can touch the soul economics is separate if they come pakistan is come and they start taking the bread and butter of our people and then they have their you know uh, kind of roots going deep into the middle east it's a different issue i am not getting into the politics of it but music music has to have no religion music cannot have any nationality but our I own mean. music, music no our own music is such a rich music ye baatein to bahut hoti rahengi but uh, you know have you ever had a chance to meet with uh, or sing with uh, my most favorite peoples 
uh, some people uh, jagjit singh ji i did a song uh, i i recorded a song i didn't sing with him but we've been on the same platform a number of times uh, jagjit ji ke sath gaaye hain balki general vk singh ki baat ki what a wonderful person uh, so forthright uh, such dignity so much fortitude and his whole family is into helping into into uh, making a better india including his daughter mrinalini they're all there for making a better country why i i i went on to that is because i've done a lot of shows for the army usme maine kafi shows kiye hain jahan kafi artists aate hain from all over kargil ka mahina hai kargil ka mahina hai art sainikon ki baat ab jab chhidi gayi hai aur hamara vision india forum to we are uh, you know uh, what do you call unequivocally grateful to the entire services fraternity as i told you Absolutely. right from yeah so ek ghazal wo kuch line banti hai jo army ke liye aap samarpit kare ji ji ne army ke liye to hum to itne shows kiye hain not necessary uh, uh, i've been to uh, Uh, to uh, Leh, Ladakh many times, to Jabalpur, I've been to Ambala. I have done a lot of places where I interact with the forces. I remember one of the songs they love is uh, uh, because it was uh, Dev Anand Sahab who had sung it. He was an army officer in that particular film. The film is Hum Dono. Sangeetkar was Jaydev Ji and the singer was Rafi Sahab. Karchale Hampida. Karchale Hampida. Karchale Hampida. No, it is मैं जिंदगी का साथ निभाता चला गया हर फिक्र को धुए में उड़ाता चला गया हर फिक्र को धुए में उड़ाओं का सुख बर्बादियों का सुख मनाजूल था मनाना फजूल था आपकी तो बड़ी गजलें हैं आपके बड़े भजन है अच्छा वट यू लाइक मोर दजल्स और दजल There's nothing like that. गाना गाना होता है वो कुछ भी हो भजन हो गजल हो गजल इज वेरी क्लोज टू माई हार्ट गजल अच्छा नेता फाजली की गजल है इट्स आर्टिस्ट की जिंदगी के ऊपर उन्होंने बहुत अच्छी एक, एक शेर लिखा है कि तन तन दुख झेलेंगे महफिल महफिल गाएंगे जब तक आंसू पास रहेंगे तब तक गीत सुनाएंगे तन 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 दुख झेलेंगे महफिल महफिल गाएंगे जब तक आंसू पास रहेंगे तब तक गीत सुनाएंगे आई रिमेम्बर यू नो हैविंग स्पोकन टू अनूप जलोटा जी फ्यू मंथ्स बैक ही इज वन ऑफ द डियर फ्रेंड्स ऑफ द फोरम अनूप जलोटा जी तो खैर भजन सम्राट कहलाते हैं मैं तो ज्यादा जानता नहीं हूँ बट आई फील दैट आई स्टिल वेन एवर वी थिंक मतलब पीपल लाइक मी थिंक अबाउट भजन वी थिंक ऑफ ऐसी लागी लगन मीरा हो गई मगन एंड दोस काइंड ऑफ सॉन्ग्स विच अनूप जलोटा जी मेड पॉपुलराइज देन वी हैड पंकज उदास इज यू नो चिट्ठी आई है द गजल यू नो इट इज इट इज दीज आर इमोटल गजल्स सो डिड यू एवर गेट अ चांस टू वर्क विद एनी ऑफ दीज ग्रेट आर्टिस्ट अनूप जी और पंकज उदास जी दीज आर्टिस्ट यस ऑफ कोर्स वी ऑल Sing together in a concert, uh, many concerts. Anup Ji ke saath, Pankaj Ji ke saath, aur Gana bhi record kiya tha. Uh, film hai. Uh, I forget the name uh, of the film. Uh, jara, jara, uh, Vishnu Nia was the name of the film. Uski jaroor sunaiye. Kapi picture aiye. Vishnu Nia. Such movie hai. 
बहुत साल हो गए हाँ ऐसा था तो फिल्म फिल्म गाना था फिर जाने जा मुझे ऐसा क्या हुआ देखा तुझे पल भर में जन्म का नाता हुआ ऐसा कुछ था भपीदा भपीदा झलक रहे ना गाने में जाने जा मुझे ऐसा क्या हुआ देखा तुझे पल भर में जन्म का नाता हुआ ऐसा था गाना डू इट नो द इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ गजल्स एंड भजन I remember the last time I heard a beautiful ghazal uh, ghazal in a movie indian movie indian commercial movie was uh, hosh walo ko khabar kya in sarfarosh after that we hardly hear any ghazals or this kind of things uh, we can hear sufi qawalis because of the you know influence of the producers from middle east but we do not get to hear bhajans as such Uh, you know tujhe bulaya shera waliye and narendra chanchal the great bhajan singer i remember narendra chanchal ji is yara o yara in bina movie and this kind of songs are uh, you know they are uh, they, they are like in the memory interest the memory forever uh, your favorite uh, ghazals if you name three favorite ghazals from indian singer because pakistan is in a different league in a different world uh you know uh, gulam ali khan sahab do you uh, have memories of mr gulam ali khan gulam ali ji ke sath maine gaya hai gauhati mein uh wahan bupen hazari ka ji bhi the and gulam ali ji bhi the and sabne everybody has given a lot of love and because they all respect madhurani ji so much to mujhe uska fayda ho jata hai <laughs> you know no, they are very fond of people, madhuri ji madam pinaz pinaz ji so, all the people uh, we have interviewed all the people we have interviewed or we have talked to they have all uh, you know been the mirror images of their gurus that is what music is about so now three ghazals uh, which i like uh, uh one is uh, uh वैसे तो बहुत क्या क्या बताऊं आपको नहीं नहीं जो 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 में आ जाए जो पहले आ जाए जाए पहले समझ लीजिए वो वो था हाँ, वही आ, आ, मेरी जिंदगी है जालिम तेरे गम से आशिकारा तेरा गम है दर हकीकत मुझे जिंदगी से प्यारा ये शकील बदायन की गजल मुझे बहुत अच्छी लगती है ये आपने एक, एक है मिर्जा गालिब की ये न ये न थी हमारी किस्मत के विशाल यार होता अगर और जीते रहते यही इंतजार होता ये भी अच्छी लगती है तो वैसे बहुत अच्छी गजलें मुझे लगती है अलग आपने पूछा था कि भजन और या गजल फिल्म में क्यों नहीं आते हैं फिल्म इज अ टेपेस्टी ऑफ टूडेज टाइम्स अब आपने ही कहा आज की जिंदगी में इतना स्ट्रेस है भाग दौड़ है और गजल में एक नफासत है पहले जमाने में अगर कोई प्यार की बातें करते थे तो फिर बस आँखों, आँखों से ही बात होती थी आजकल के जमाने में एवरीथिंग इज सो फास्ट गजल बिचारी क्या करेगी आज के पिक्चरों में पीपल वन चट मंगी पट गया बस तो वो टेपिस्ट्री हैज चेंज सो म्यूजिक हैज द लाइकिंग ऑफ म्यूजिक हैज चेंज और भजन के लिए वो उस टाइप का कुछ चाहिए ना फिल्म जहाँ आप जैसे साईं बाबा जी का कोई पिक्चर बनाए तब भजन होगा या जैसे टीवी सीरियल्स होते हैं महाभारत रामायण तब कोई होगा भजन वैसे आज के जनरेशन के पिक्चर्स में भजन वगैरह नहीं होते ना सर यू नो पर इट वाज वेरी नाइस टॉकिंग टू जी छठ मंगनी पट भी आई नो यू नो व्हेन वी टॉक टू पीपल लाइक यू नॉट ओनली यू most of the monologues they get stressed to a much more duration longer duration than what we uh, initially think of and it becomes sometimes so enthralling as it has been because you know you come from a very differently most people that we've been talking to from the music industry are from the classical music background people who are uh, greats of classical music like pandit ri prasad chaurasia ji and all these people uh, and when i talk to you it's a totally different feeling you know uh, today today i mean in today's generation uh, or in today's bollywood do you think that uh, ghazals can make a comeback or do they have a 
जहाँ आप फिल्मों की बात करते हैं तो अगर कोई ऐसी कोई पिक्चर बनती है जिसमें गजल की जरूरत है तो जरूर होगी गजल बट एंड एनी फॉर्म ऑफ म्यूजिक जो गजल भी गाते हैं या जो हम इट इज ऑल अ फॉर्म ऑफ क्लासिकल म्यूजिक सो वी कैन नॉट से क्लासिकल म्यूजिक अलग है और गजल म्यूजिक अलग है बैकग्राउंड क्लासिकल का होना ही चाहिए फिल्म इंडस्ट्री में कभी कभी जब मैंने ज्वाइन किया था तब कहते थे कि क्लासिकल म्यूजिक मत सीखो इससे आवाज खराब हो जाती आई यूज टू फील के कमाल का आदमी है भैया क्लासिकल म्यूजिक ना सीखो आवाज खराब हो जाएगी सो दिस वॉज मोर इन द फिल्म इंडस्ट्री बट इन दजल ट्रेडिशन यू हैव टू बी यू हैव टू नो योर म्यूजिक इन ऑर्डर योर फाउंडेशन ही अगर खराब होगा तो इमारत क्या बनाएंगे आप साउथ इंडियन इंफ्लुएंस ऑफ दिस साउथ इंडियन इंडस्ट्री और uh the presence of ghazals and bhajans or people like you have you worked with the south people because that's a completely a huge I world had, in its own uh, i had a i had an opportunity of working with dr balamulili krishna the 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 veteran the legendary dr balamulili krishna so i had met him in a series uh, which was done by mr chibba where north indian artists were interviewing south indian uh, 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 artists to so, maine dr balamuri krishna ji ke sath baat ki thi aur dr chitti babu so balamuri ji was very fascinated with the uh, ghazal and a particular ghazal which i used to sing dile nada he was very fascinated so unko ek film mein gana karna tha and he, so he called me to chennai and i recorded a, i think a telugu telugu song with him as a duet it was a super no, no, this you have to sing you have to sing with this I, song you don't think it will go no that song you remember the words it was like i yaad hi nahi hai uh mind the errors in the language but it went like the country of top south indian film uh, you know uh, music directors like pandit uh, ramesh narayan who will be watching this interview and if you can really do this good job are you going to be a I don't remember the words but it went like dan tak chile po me tadve kullunde dan tak chile po me tadve kullunde tadvendra muttamadai tadvendra muttamadai somebody from the southern film industry you know uh, now now going forward thank you so what, much amit what, what, pinaz ji what are you now we will be going having <laughs> i mean going forward in the next 3 4 minutes we'll close the show we'll close the show in 3 to 4 minutes time just a few few important questions what are your yes. uh, suggestions to the uh, uh, film industry number 1 to the government and and government. yeah to the government to the film industry for music you know and lastly uh, for the for the uh, society and the youngsters so let's start from the for, let's start from society and youngsters we must have a lot of pride in our country in our culture in our music we have everything in our country it's a very very rich heritage bahar ke log hame copy karte hain ab ja ke yoga मेडिटेशन uh, पूरी दुनिया सीख कर रही है कि हमें शांति कैसे मिले हमें शांति तो हमें नींद चाहिए हमें सोना है हमें अच्छी तरह से सुकून चाहिए सुकून ढूंढ रहे हैं आज की दुनिया 
जो हमारे हिंदुस्तान में हमारे ऋषि मुनि उस्ताद उस्तानी म्यूजिक दे हैव पीस पीस ऑफ माइंड तो ये बहुत जरूरी है डोंट रन आफ्टर ऑफकोर्स टूडे यू नीड मनी इट्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बट इन सीकिंग इट इन सीकिंग द क्रीचर कल्चर्स ऑफ लाइफ डोंट डोंट बी रेस्टलेस बी ग्राउंडेड be grounded it will help you to have a longer life is better to have a long peaceful life than a short life full of full of material things you're not going to carry anything up to heaven so have a good peaceful restful life work hard have your object objectives but have a ki hame bas itna karna itna kamana hai uske baad apne liye jeena hai if you only after wealth and isne iske paas ye gaadi hai mere paas bhi gaadi hai ye aapko dubo dega don't do it second question second question was what was your uh, advice to our government we we got a wonderful uh, country with a very strong government so please help musicians help in the sense support hamare sangeet jo hai ye dharohar hai isko it's a it's a dekhiye you know it's so sad ki hamare jo classical artists hai ya jo bhi artist hai उनके बच्चों उनके बच्चे आजकल दे डोंट वांट टू फॉलो द ट्रेडिशन बिकॉज हर एक सारंगी नवाज कहेंगे कि मेरा बच्चा सारंगी बजा के क्या कमाएगा दिस इज अ वेरी वेरी डेंजरस थिंग टू हैपन यू मस्ट हैव इंस्टीट्यूशंस टू सपोर्ट म्यूजिशियंस एंड द आर्ट बिकॉज एक पूरा जनरेशन चला जाएगा वी विल नॉट हैव एनीथिंग विद अस हम सिर्फ एलपी रिकॉर्ड्स में सुनेंगे कि ऐसा एक इंस्ट्रूमेंट होता था जो सारंगी कहते थे ये होता था जैसे ये कहते थे मस्ट हैव इंस्टीट्यूशंस टू सपोर्ट फाइनेंशियली क्लासिकल आर्टिस्ट आर्टिस्ट जो भी अपने आर्टिस्ट है उसको सपोर्ट करना है एक घर है उनको एक आमदनी हो उनको टीचर्स की तरह से उनको करो जो आप कर रहे हैं आईसीसीआर डज इट मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ कल्चर डज इट उस उसको करना है एंड व्हाट इज द फर्स्ट वन what advice do you have to the industry music yeah yeah, yeah. for the overall movie yeah. industry film industry film music industry. industry film industry wo to alag it's not my uh, field as such i've sung for a couple of films they are doing a great job they are hamare uh, i'm sure aajkal filme banti hain jisme uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, scope uh, i hope there's more scope for music and tradition and uh, uh, and a culture also you see i i i i, you know, I know so i mean people like uh, mr sonu nigam uh, they 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 have been airing a lot of disenchantment towards the kind of uh, nepotism and the kind of music that is being made and uh, uh, melody has completely gone off the roof out of the roof so uh, i i personally believe melody has to come back uh, the 90s uh, the earlier you know 50s 60s 70s melody early, was earlier melody is aisi honi chahiye jo jaise hum purane gaane hi kyun ga rahe hain naye gaane kyun nahi ga rahe kyunki usme kuch samajh mein nahi aa raha to jo purani cheeze hain agar we recreate them lekin wo log bhi to nahi rahe hain wo log hi nahi rahe hain jo jinhone ek ek gaane ke liye 10 10 15 15 baar rehearsal yani कितनी रिहर्सलें नैयर साहब के लिए मैंने गाया ओपी नैयर कितनी रिहर्सलें करवाते थे जयदेव जी हो इवन पंचमदा दे टू बी अ होल टीम वर्किंग नॉट ये एडिट एंड फ्लाई बाय नाइट ऑपरेटर्स के आओ अपना लाइन गालो कोई म्यूजिशियन यहाँ बैठा है बस आप कर लो पैसे लो जाओ अनलेस अनलेस तभी तो रफी साहब पैदा हुए थे लता जी पैदा हुई थी आशा जी पैदा हुई थी इवन सोनू निगम इज डूइंग सच अ वंडरफुल जॉब you need to uh, soak in the music you need time to digest that song which you are going to sing you need, it's not a factory we just generate songs that suit the picture and so ye wo time ye alag tha it was a different time it was slow paced that's you why know, it was wonderful i uh, i must thank you so much pinaz ji you have been so thank kind you, like like most of you people your colleagues have been so kind you know we've been uh, we have a you know battery and a host of uh, top uh, singers uh, performing arts people film stars directors who are going to be joining this bandwagon because uh, we are very sure we want to make india 
regain its glory of melody music and global make india and the world realize the the superpower that india is in as far as music is concerned because yes uh, you are right when you say chat mangni pat piya but if music is ignored any further chat mangni pat piya or usse bhi jaldi divorce is something what we can be ready for look forward madam amit ji you are doing a wonderful job amit ji carry on your good work and all the best and to our amrit mahotsav aapko aur bhi hum logo ko support karte rehna hai aap jaise logo ko ye shuruaat hai ye shuruaat thank you namaskar